and Snowy Evening will complete the line for the Suzy O'Kane. They're in the gate. And they're off. It was a smooth start. I'm just kidding, smoky eyes, and on the inside, Kasuke is up to take the lead, and tugging as well. Kasuke will be the pace setter, and just behind them, collaboration is pretty eager once again on the outside, three wide going into the first turn, and about two lengths off of Kasuke. They're followed at the rail by Smoky Eyes, who now settles in for it, snowy evening with the orange sleeves, fifth and six lengths off the leader, Silver Skillet. Under a stranglehold at this stage, racing two and a half in front of Burnt again. Orange Freeze will do her best running a little bit later on. She is just two lengths in front of Thundara. 23 and 3 for the opening quarter mile. It's Kasuke just in front. I'm just kidding. In between rivals, second. And on the outside of them, Collaboration is now backed off to be three off the pace. The half went in 46 and four fifth seconds. Still a pretty decent gap back to Smoky Eyes and Snowy Evening who are fourth and fifth. Silver Skillet about 10 lengths off the pace. Burnt again is next. Orange Freeze at the back of the field and then Thundara asked for a bit more. They round the far turn, I'm just kidding. Putting the pressure on Kasuke. They're on even terms as they reach the top of the stretch. Six furlongs in, 111 and one. Smoky Eyes is just behind them in third. Orange Freeze in the center of the course and Silver Skillet very confidently handled in the middle is coming now. And Silver Skillet emerges with the lead, takes off past the 16th pole and opens up to be much best in the Suzy O'Kane. Silver Skillet and Joel Rosario making short work of the competition. Orange Freeze completes the exacta then burnt again in smoky eyes. 